Hey guys, what's up? Um, I'm out here on Catfish Lake Road, and uh, it's actually a nice sunny day out. It was actually pretty cool last night, so uh, a lot of the herps are going to be out on the road basking for the day. Just get warm up. And uh, what you're looking at right here is a uh, baby red belly water snake, um, or uh, Neurodia eithrogaster. I think that's how it goes, eithrogaster. But, uh, but yeah, a very common snake, and um, there's a lot of these babies out here, um, especially where there's water and uh, a mixture of uh, woods and stuff, a lot of woods. And uh, you can see he's pretty pissed. He's flattening out, and he's gotten that, he's flattening out his head. And if I uh, provoke him enough, he'll likely bite, but it's all right. I mean, just a little baby water snake. But yeah, um, very common snake. He just bit me. Um, and um, you can see that uh, as babies, their uh, belly isn't completely red. It's more of a, a uh, yellowish-orange color. And, um, oh, he bit the camera. That was kind of nice. But yeah, um, very common snake. Um, very beautiful, too. Uh, as babies, they have uh, actually a blotched pattern. Um, they uh hold on these rocks are annoying but yeah um they have a blotched pattern as babies and you can see he's rearing up look at that beautiful little snake um yeah he's a male because uh i looked at his tail and he's got a really wide tail base it doesn't matter how young they are they just have a distinctive oh, look at that but yeah um no oh, he just bit me again uh, very bitey snakes. Look at that. Um, very common too. Like I said, um, you mostly see them in habitats like this. They uh, they are actually uh, more likely to be found on land than in water because they're just so uh, terrestrial. Uh, look at that. Damn. <laughs> but yeah, they're so terrestrial. Um, little fella. Um, but yeah, um, they travel over land more than any other water snake. Uh, Oh, damn. Things freaking biting like crazy. Um, but yeah, uh, in a second I'm going to let him go. But uh, first I just want to... Ow! Crazy little thing. Ow! It's a little aggressive. And um, as you see with most water snakes, they have keeled scales. And uh, what a lot of people think that's for is just to make them look like more like water moccasins. But in fact, it's actually to reduce uh, um, water resistance. So it's actually... Uh, um, very easy for them to swim and um, these guys are excellent swimmers too uh, they actually have a flattened tail not flat like a sea snake but uh, just really uh, um, just flattish sort of um, you can see it's right here oh. and um, yeah uh, they're really fast little jumpy snakes let me show you um, what the water snakes will generally do to move fast is leap like this See. See how he kind of leaps up in the air? And when I grab him, he kind of flattens out his head. And um, these guys are excellent at mimicking the water moccasin or the eastern cottonmouth. Um, because what they'll do is what they're doing right now is uh, flatten their hood out. Or not hood, but flatten their head out. Dang, freaking thing lunged at my face. Look at you. Look at you. Crazy little thing. Um, but yeah, um, very common snake. Like I said a couple million times before, look at you, you're about to bite my face. Ow! <laughs> but yeah, he's a little f funny little guy. Um, yeah, as babies are easy to identify from other water snakes from the red on their uh, labias, which are right there. You see he's still biting. Um, but yeah, uh, very beautiful snake too. Um, as adults, they generally lose the blotched pattern, and they'll be a, a bronze uh, brown color, and their belly will turn a bright orange to a red. And he's already starting to get it. This little fellow was probably born last year, last August, maybe October. And um, what's interesting about water snakes is that they actually give birth to live young. Um, most colubrids give birth to egg, or not give birth, but they lay eggs. Um, there's garter snakes will actually lay eggs too, or not lay eggs, but uh, damn, I'm getting... they'll actually give birth too. Um, just really weird. I mean, look at you. 
very beautiful snake. Uh, I took some pictures of him before I made this video. So, uh, yeah, um, I'm going to let him go. Right over here. Oh, I slipped. There's some, uh, I'm not sure what side to let him go on because there's some pretty big fish that I saw. So, I'm going to let him go right here on this log. And I'll uh, let him slide in. There he goes. Bye, fella. So, yeah, um, pretty interesting. Um, red belly water snake. So, um, I'm gonna go out and do some more harping, and, uh, until next time, see ya.